If his 18,000 naira Buari is collecting, how is he going to make his medical at that abroad that they take them to? But why now? Even though the 30,000 naira is not even still okay, but it's manageable. They can start with it because of the level they have. Let's just to be realistic. If it's 13,000 naira or 18,000 naira Buari is collecting, how is he going to? How is he going to meet up sending his children abroad? There's a huge possibility that on the 6th of November 2018, there's going to be another national lockdown of activities by labor workers. This is not far-fetched, as the federal government and the labor union uh, congress have refused to agree on the particular amount to be paid as minimum wage. My name is Dam Lario Konla, you're watching Legit TV. Okay, today we're asking people on the streets what they think about this tussle between the federal government and the NLC. Is 30,000 Naira too much for the federal government to pay? Let's find out. A small solution now is collecting more than almost 36 million. If they can divide that millions, 36 million, I think I even pay hundreds workers. So I don't think that 30,000 Naira is, is, uh, is, too, is too much. It's, it's what the federal government can afford to pay. But why are they not agreeing to pay? It's because of their... Uh, they are selfish, selfishness. I don't understand me. They are not care about the about the masses. They are not care about the workers. Workers who are working for eight hours, twelve hours, and they are only working for only two or three hours. Now they are on, they are on, uh, on uh, vacation now. I don't understand me. And uh, where the workers they are not on vacation. They are still working. So as far as the, uh, is, uh, if, if a commissioner, I mean a commissioner, a senator, a government can be collected millions of naira. I don't see anything why a, a workers, a worker, government worker, cannot be collecting under under thousand naira, at least a minimum. So it, by saying that they cannot be able to pay the money, they are not ready to pay it. So they don't love the masses. They don't love the people who are, that we vote them in there. They don't love us. If they love us, the money is too much. Let them slack their own money down. Let, let, let them be collecting what the, the, the civil servants are collecting. Let's see whether they can be able to cope. We are trying. We civil servants are trying. We, we sacrifice our life. To make sure that this government, this uh, country is moving forward, but they are not, they are not helping us. They are not helping our family. So I can look at that thirty thousand naira. I can they, so a man survive with thirty thousand naira. What can thirty thousand buy now? But we, we, we didn't even complain. We still wanted to pay that money. We didn't say hundred thousand. We didn't say fifty thousand. Thirty thousand. They said they are not complaining. They are not. They don't. They cannot afford to pay it. Then any government who's not ready to pay, only government. They should leave. You don't need to fight for them. Let them go. Let them go. People who are ready to pay, they will come in and pay. We have resources in this country. To me, the amount is not too much. That amount is not uh, the, enough. That 30,000 is okay. But that 22, 5 is not okay. Or 24 is not okay. Things are hard. Very, very hard. Compared to what uh, the senators and uh, they are receiving. That 30,000 is even too small. How much is enough? Let for me, 50,000. Because things are very hard. Buari is not even getting it right. How much is he receiving? He's suffering the masses. People that voted him in. So I left for me, this regime, they are not doing well at all, at all. They are not doing well. What are we talking of change? Is that the level of, is that what is called change? 22,000 Naira. What will it solve? Even to a, a, a student that is in second is university. That 22,000 naira will not be enough for that student. Let's say civil servant that goes to work every day on civil attire. How much is the dress? How much are they selling material in the market? Talk less or give you some at the end of the month to give him 30,000 naira. And he says it's too much. It's not too much. If they feel they can pay, they're supposed to pay. Not that if they fail, I wish they would pay to make things better for Nigeria. They don't let them think of the common man in the city. Let them think of those who are working. You work for 35 years, you will not be able to have a home of your own. Is it encouraging? Uh, you answer me, is it encouraging? Uh, so why didn't they feel, is there enough of them that work for four years that they don't have a home of its own? Those political leaders, four years they will have enough, but those living, working, work for 35 years, they don't have nothing to talk about. They are, they, they are greedy, if they are not greedy, they know that these people, they are the ones working for this money because they, for, for them to see income, in government, it is this government worker that will generate from the tax collector everything. 
they generate this money from these people. Now you generate from them for you to now pay them back. You don't want to pay them. You can see the situation of the country now everything is cost. For them, for their transportation from their house to their working place. I know of somebody that is spending nothing less than 11000 in a month for transport. And that is the minimum. Before it was spending more than that. But now you can see the way things is now. Because of their selfish uh, interest, because they want to loot money by all means to re elect themselves into the uh, office. That's so, why they're not paying. Yeah, that's why they are dragging. They are not going to pay. This is that, this is that, and so on. Something needs to be done. And this is the right time, because 2019 is fast approaching. And these men are trying to like use our head again. So we need to like hold them at ransom now, so that by the time we are going there to vote, we will know who to vote. That's just it, man. Okay, Nigerians are not happy. Everybody is not happy with the federal government because they believe that we have enough money to pay these guys, but we're just refusing to pay. They said for selfish interests. What do you say? What do you think about this? My name is Dam Larry Okonla. Big shout out to Emmanuel Sodi, the man behind the camera. Until we come your way some other time on Stooges on Legit TV, do not forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel. Like us on Facebook, follow us on Twitter and on Instagram. Have a great day.